if there's a little give in the ground on uh, Friday for the two stakes races, would it uh, impact either one of your horses? No, I, I don't think so. I think uh, both horses uh, can uh, um, adjust to a little juice in the ground. Um, obviously, Going Good had some success last time on a, a muddy track, and uh, or actually a really, really sloppy track. So, you know, we feel like she's, she's honest and she'll run on anything as well as Darnay. Tell me about that last race for Going Good uh, at Oakland. Well, she missed the break, and. Uh, it didn't seem like the inside part of the track was playing very well that day, but they um, they actually had the runners positioned out. Like the one hole, the one horse was actually in like the four or five holes. So uh, Florent never had a chance with the way she broke, never had a chance to get to the outside. She had nearly been on the outside fence. So, um, you know, he did the best he could given we just didn't get away very well. And, uh, you know, she, she uh, ran a big race. She, she's a good filly. She really is. And, and you think she's good on either surface? I do. I really do. She's two for two on the turf to start her career, and we're, we're back here on Friday on the grass. So I'm hopeful that you know, she'll, she'll make a good count of herself. And in the maker's mark mile with Del Rain, um, you think the mile, what do you see that makes you think the mile is a better distance than what he was running over in Europe? I feel like there, if there's some speed in the race, that, that, that you know they'll be able to get away from him a little bit. He'll be able to relax and kick home well. Um, that, that's kind of what we're hoping for. Um, you know, he's obviously showed the ability to run further than a mile. But, you know, we're ho hopeful that he could be a top horse in America at the mile, mile 60, mile 8 distance. What has impressed you about him in those two races that caused you to take this swing? Probably his turn of uh, foot and how he really fought it down the lane at the fairgrounds. Uh, his first race, he didn't win, but it was came back it came back a really fast race. And the horse that beat him went on to run a big race. I think he was second to uh, Colonel uh, Liam um, in the uh, Muniz. So, you know, he kept good company there. And then he came back and won the first level allowance. Uh, you know, defeated another good horse, the horse there that was second to a solid enough horse. And, you know, he, he put him away fairly easy down the lane. So, you know, he, he, he definitely has some class and ability.